<laughs> you know, I was just wondering how you're going to be, you know, at 9.30 tomorrow morning. Are you prepared? I'm prepared. I'm all right. I'm all right with it. And how... I'm all right with it, but like I said, remember and tell, let them know that I know that the cops knew who I was after Richard Mallory died. I left prints everywhere and they covered it up and let me kill the rest of those guys to turn me into a serial killer. I know they did because I was no professional serial killer or anything, or murderer or whatever you want to call it, you know. It wasn't special at so, what I was doing. I, mean, how, I did how, some sloppy work, you know, and I left how you? I wish I could take that thing back. I don't know. I don't really wish I could take anything back. I think it's unhealthy to to regret yeah. anything. It's just not a functional way to 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 exist. Um, so I just try not to think about that. I can't change anything. So why spend time dwelling on that? It yeah. just is what it is, and you just have to be resilient and move forward and accept that you can't control everything and um, I can't control people's perception. I just I can only enjoy my own life and enjoy creating what I can control in my art and that's it. Like, yeah. I just don't really think about that. It's unhealthy to, to victimize yourself and it's also unhealthy to blame yourself. You just have to have a balance of being accountable, not sensationalizing your, your life or what's like going on ar around you. I try to just like stay grounded in that and just focus on what is my reality and what I can control in that, this moment and not really ponder that too much. Ha 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 ha